Start from standing with Kennedy. So I have my left leg as a lead leg, which means that I have to grab his collar with my right hand. So grab the collar, the way I'm doing so, grab the sleeve, push him back. I'm going to step forward simultaneously to the side and hold the sleeve. That's the side that goes to the hip. Hook behind his knee with my right hook. Pick him up. Close guard immediately. Kenny's doing such a good job by isolating my hips with his elbows. I grab the sleeves. Okay? So once I grab the sleeves, it's time for me to play the spider guard. Right foot goes to the mat. I'm going to hip out. Get the shield first. Kenny's doing such a good job. It's, Kenny's doing such a good job on not letting me free this foot, right? Free my left leg. So go for it. And then what we'll do, I use my right foot on the mat, hip up, and get to the shield. Once I get the shield over here, I'm playing the spider guard. Now I need to get my feet on Kenny's biceps. I'm going to get one foot at a time on his biceps. I shrink to my right side, get the foot on the biceps. Now what I'll do, I bring my heel towards my butt, square up a bit. If you get it super tight on the side, I can't get my foot on the bicep. What I'll do, I hip out, and then I get the foot on the bicep, the other one. Now I square up with Kennedy, and now I'm going immediately to one side. Kennedy, as soon as I do that, he's going to do the combat base. Beautiful. And what I'll do now, I'm going to lift my hips, simultaneously break the grip, use this leg as a pendulum, come up on my elbow, and I'll be able to do the spider guard scissor whip and release the foot off Kenny's bicep going straight to the mouth position and as soon as I go to the, the mouth position I'm going to insert the hooks the way I'm doing so and Kenny's going to test my balance one two three four immediately get to the headlock mouth control right arm right hook Kenny's going to test my balance one two three pummeling one, two, three. Grab the rest with my left hand. Feet to my right hand. Left hand goes over, I mean under my arm. Grab my own wrist, excuse me. So my left hand is going under Kenneth's arm. Grab my own wrist, look his head over. Get my elbow right on Kenneth's neck to make sure Kenneth doesn't turn into me. Stop. Ken is going to test my balance. One, two, three. And then when Ken grabs around my back, go for it. I insert the other hook. Go for it. One, two, three. And when Ken stops again, I insert the hook back and slowly seal the deal. Okay? American arm lock. When I finish Kennedy, I'm going back again. I'm going to insert my hooks. And if Kennedy wants to bump and turn to the side, go ahead, go for it. I'm going straight to the modified mount. So when I go to the modified mount over here, Ken is going to stop in this position. When he stops in this position, what we'll do, this right hand goes under and grabs my own collar. I move a little bit more on the side, the way I'm doing so, my knee should be as a pillow, my left knee should be as a pillow for Ken's head. This hand over here, push, there it is. Yeah, that way Ken won't be able to face me. Once I do that, I'm gonna turn this way, Push, look at my foot, my right foot, walk, 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 my heels is going under Kenny's armpit. Once I do that, my hand is still on the side, now I'm going to point my knee right towards his legs, that way I can sit on Kenny's ribs and I'll be able to step the leg over and sit back. Once I sit back, you squeeze, uh, bring your heels towards your butt first, pinch your knees together and I still have my collar. When I break in his grip, I'm going to grab the wrist, the way I'm doing so, and the hand I was grabbing the collar, we shake the hand, okay, by keeping Kenny's thumb pointing to the ceiling. Squeeze my knees together, lift the hips, and finish on the straight armbar from the mounting position.